What's up guys, Bookum here, back with another book review in our horror series. And before I even get into this book, just a disclaimer, uh, there's a lot of body gore in this book and it's surrounded by a touchy subject. If you're screaming to body gore, um, probably not something you wanna read, but if it's something that you're into, this would probably be a great read. So without further ado, uh, this book is called Piercing by Ryu Mirakami. Uh, and this book is set in Tokyo, Japan, and it follows a guy named Kawashima who has this sudden urge to want to stab his three month old daughter with an ice pick. And so usually uh, he wakes up around three or four o'clock in the morning and he's standing over his child's crib uh, with an ice pick and he's profusely sweating. And so um, this book follows Kawashima who sort of tries to um, remedy or figure out uh, why he has this urge to want to stab uh, specifically his daughter with an ice pig, but want to stab anybody, want to hurt or, you know, inflict pain on anybody. He ends up uh, ordering a prostitute and the plot thickens at that point. Something very particular about this prostitute that I don't want to give away, it, he finds it really hard to um, stab this prostitute with an ice pig and the situation surrounding around uh, the specific prostitute that he has and himself uh, is um, really, really interesting. And so uh, this book is a, uh, it's action packed for one. Um, and it, it it's not a slow read. So you, you get into it, it's not that long, but um, it gets you involved very quickly and uh, you start reading it and you can follow along really, really well. Uh, so it had me going all the way up to the end. Um, so in terms of the writer style of the author, you hear about people who sort of have like these disturbing and in intrusive thoughts. Well, this guy writes an entire novel on intrusive thoughts. I mean, and he's really, really, really not afraid to uh, depict the unhinged corners of somebody's mind. I mean, the type of things uh, that, that, first of all, the premise of this book in itself is uh, wild. Like you wouldn't think that somebody would write about this. And so this is kind of the first author that I've uh, come into contact with or read one of their books who has a writing style like that. So I really, really, really enjoyed that. You guys like uh, this book, uh, you should also read In the Miso Soup is also, I think, a really, really good one by Ryu Mirakami. So yeah, uh, check out um, Piercing. Uh, let me know what you guys think. And yeah, thanks for stopping by.